all right been a while since we did a review video on anything got a few new things so uh first video got the ruger 57 i had the other one the uh, fn it was good it was all right looked kind of hokey it's kind of kind of weird in my hand so i uh sold it got this one a thousand times better in my opinion um, I know there's going to be some of the internet trolls coming out saying that, uh, you know, whatever. It's all personal preference, really. I've had good luck with this one. No jams, no malfunctions. Uh, there's videos that say there are jams and malfunctions. There's videos that say there's FN jams and malfunctions. So, again, it's just personal preference. I didn't like the FN very much. Um, very well-made weapon. I just didn't like it. Uh, so, sold it, got the Ruger couple of things I really like about it is the ergonomics the way it fits my hand very nice safety's in a really good spot it has the trigger safety as well much like uh, the Glock style I guess you could call it and this one will fire without the magazine in it the FN has to have the magazine in it I don't imagine many situations where you would have the the magazine out with the round in the chamber need to fire it but if it ever did arise this one can do that the grip much better kind of a factory stipple going on i'm not a big stippling fan but uh real nice real comfy not very wide so it fits in the hand real good i got bigger hands and uh i just think it's wonderful high vis sight got the real nice adjustable rear sight and then a couple little screws there I guess you could put one of those uh big old can't hit the brass out of a barn little sight window thingies on there uh, a little bit of porting on the end of the barrel front serrations a little tack rail uh, in case whatever civilian situation you're in you might raid crack houses or something like that i don't do that so my guns aren't all tactic cooled out but uh you know if you're just a everyday average shooter that that goes on police raids or anything like that you know you got to have all the extra accessories so you can uh be the big beard tactical guy but that's pretty much it good weapon uh got quite a few rounds through it so far no jams no malfunctions Seems to run good, uh, keep it clean, and so far I, I think it's fantastic, hands down better than the FN, about half the price, about twice the performance in my opinion, so can't go wrong with that, right?